Another model launched, this time a small model called Phi 3, PHI Phi 3 by Microsoft. Uh, they have, uh, I think, few variants. They have Phi 3 Mini, which is a 3.8 billion parameter model, which can run locally on your laptop. You have a Phi 3 Small, uh, which is a 7 billion model, and a Phi 3 Medium, which is a 14 billion model. Now, the best part is, when it comes to RAG frame, uh, kind of workloads, where uh, you don't need the model to do a lot of reasoning, you don't need the model to do a lot of generation, RAG is all about searching and, and consume and bringing back the content from your data that you supply. Uh, Phi 3 Mini is fantastic because uh, it has decent generation skills, which is it can write grammatically correct sentences. It can chat really well uh, with your data. So, so for all your local chatbots or agent frameworks, uh, if you need a model that's really, really fast, then something like Phi 3 is uh, really, really good to uh, use. Uh, the other fantastic application for Phi 3, which we eventually recently figured out was, you can fine tune a small model like Phi 3 and integrate directly with a voice API, like a, like a deep gram, and you will have an ultra fast uh, voice bot up and running. Uh, for your data, right? It is slightly different from the RAG use case because in case of RAG, uh, it is more of retrieving the data and augmenting and presenting it back to you. But in case of fine tuning a small language model, uh, you are limited by the amount of data that you can use to fine tune the model. But at the same time, the speed is fantastic. Like if you integrate with the deep gram, you can, the, the latency is like sub in, in milliseconds. I'm talking about uh, 300 milliseconds or uh, or even lower so so the best part is uh, um, you can use olama uh, and run phi3 uh, locally on your uh, machine you can have lizer agents again run locally on your machine and the whole thing works seamlessly for you you can have a fully private chat agent or a knowledge search agent or even a multi-agent workflow running locally on your server or on your laptop and if you don't know how to do that you have GoML here fantastic AI engineers and experts who can come in and help but that is I mean I see a massive uh, usage for Phi 3 as we move forward like small language models no absolutely I think uh, and, and in this way right Microsoft did while obviously they are heavily reliant on OpenAI but I think with the Phi series right Shiva they've really proved that you know it it what matters probably is the quality of data Right. And, and if I go back to probably how this started, the five series, they had curated a very small data set, but very good content data set, right? Which allows you to probably run these models on your Windows laptops, right? You don't need probably to spend GPUs, etc. You don't have to even to come to cloud, right? But at the same time, you get a good, a good accuracy. So it's not the amount of data, but it's the probably quality of data that is actually required. So I think that's what Microsoft is innovating into, which is a very welcome change.